Hey everybody, whether you're 18 or 80, married forever, divorced, widowed, dating, or recently acquitted for having gotten rid of somebody you can't stand, everybody wants to know the secret of love and relationships. Uh, I guess you're just getting out of a relationship, huh? You may not look exactly like the person standing next to me, but I'll tell you one thing, you're probably interested in relationships right now because everybody is. What sign are you? I'm a Capricorn. The politics of Cap for Capricorn right now in relationships means simply this. If you want to play with the big kids, you got to be political. Are you in a relationship now? I am. Happy? Oh, of course. Well, everybody always says they're happy. Is this the beginning or is it the middle or the end? Oh, uh, I hope it's the middle. I don't know if you know anything about astrology, but Saturn is in Libra right now and it's going retrograde. So what that means is that people are doubting. Mm -hmm. They're not really sure of whether it's going to go forward or not. And usually one person wants to go forward while somebody's holding back. Does that make sense? Yeah, I guess that's a possibility. What's happening is that somebody is really getting bored. And people want change, especially right now. They want change to happen. And one person is scared of the change. The other person wants it. And yet both people are a little bored. Between now and June, that relationships are going to go through their trial period. And you can't rush it and don't push. Does that make sense to you? It does. So just push on and you see what happens in June. June, OK. I'll hold you to that. <laughs> Outside is frightful, but the fire is so delightful. Since we've no place to go, let it snow. Let it snow. Now, I like this. I'm an ice skater and I love outdoors and uh, I love hot chocolate. And what's your first name? Michael. What's yours? Emily. Emily. Emily was my first girlfriend in seventh grade. <laughs> I loved her. I wrote her name all over my books. And then it was my, one of my favorite dogs was Emily, but, you know. Hey, tell me, uh, have you ever been in love? Yeah. I'm Are you love. currently in love? Yeah. Oh, is this a new thing? Uh, a couple of years. Oh, well, that's, do you still feel it for each other? Yeah, I think so. That's, oh, that's, what sign are you? Taurus. No, tell me, so you're in the throes of a relationship. That's great. You know what? One of the things that, let me take this thing off. There. I feel better now. If you're a Taurus and he's a Leo, you're probably pushing him toward career things more. I try to. Yeah. So tell me, uh, do you think that people are destined for each other? No. What, do you think it's an accident? I think that um, there are, some people are better for you than others. Do you think that astrology has anything to do with bringing people I, together? Yeah, I think so. One of the things that's great about Taurus and Leo is they're both forever people. Mm -hmm. The thing is they're both stubborn. Yeah, definitely. What's his name? Jordan. Jordan. Is he also a journalist? No, he wants to be a personal trainer. A personal trainer? Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God, because, you know, Taurus is not that into athletic. I like working out, though. You do? Yeah. I think you okay. you got to be careful, though. When you're married 40 years to Jordan, <laughs> you got to be careful that your waistline doesn't rip match your age because okay. Tauruses tend to love to eat. <laughs> <laughs> so... If you happen to be in a relationship and you're still in love, here's what I think you ought to do. Take a picture of yourselves kissing. Print it, frame it, and put it on the wall. And then when you're fighting over something stupid, which is what everything turns out to be, look at that picture and remember how much you really do love each other. For Horoscope Alley, I'm Michael Luton saying bye-bye. Lights are turned down low.